Welcome to the Old Boar Plays City Skylines. This is a tutorial series for you to learn all about Railway 2 train networks. And in this video, I'll be showing you how to build a simple four-way train intersection. This is an industrial support rail yard. And this is our main cargo line, taking out and bringing in cargo through this branch line to our industry area. I need to get cargo into this part of the map. And for that, I'm gonna need an intersection. I'm going to show you three examples, Vanilla, Railway 2, and Railway 2 Procedural. Those are dynamic procedural tracks. So first I need to move some things out of the way. For those of you who are new to Railway 2, I'm going to show you how the vanilla track works. Take off road bending, put on anarchy, take your track straight in, make sure you have a 180 degree angle at the bottom. You need to have four nodes on either side of these tracks. We only have three here, so we'll trim this back just a bit. Now put on curve track and come out four nodes from the center of this train crossover. Click the center of your circle, then click the center circle in the crossover and then bring it out four nodes. This will work in your vanilla track game but you can see that Railway 2 looks better. You could try to manipulate these a bit with Move It. See if you can get them to straighten up a bit. So now I'm going to show you the Railway 2 train tracks. For the train crossover, I'm going to use Railway 2 2x2 two two noted. Straight track. Now for the turnout connections, I'm going to use nodeless track. That's with this icon here. Curve track. And we're going to come out four full nodes. Like the center. The center here again. Don't go under and don't go over. Needs to be right in the center. And then we'll come out four nodes. Put your cursor in the center of that circle. You can see how our sleepers are just a little bit distorted, not much. The connections are smooth. Now we'll do it on the opposite side. Now for these inside connections, we're going to come out three nodes from the center. You want to make sure that you're on this node here, not this one. Click in the center and drop down three nodes. 
make your connection. And we'll do the same for this side. Now to clean up these glitches, you want to select the bended track and slightly move it out. till the glitch cleans up. You might take this node and just move it slightly out as well. Don't want to move your nodes right where you have connections. As little as possible. And also clean those glitches up with a piece of gravel pedestrian path and you can clean up unwanted catenaries with network skins so now I'll show you the dynamic procedural track example The dynamic procedural tracks have a brown icon and we're going to use Railway 2 Procedural 2x2. Two two. Be sure not to use the one that says Main Line. Those are higher above the ground. They have a different use. You can see that you get a better result with these dynamic procedural tracks. You can see that I connected to the wrong node. If putting your cursor in the center of that node does this, you might want to bring it down to the bottom edge of the node need to see that round curve around the outside of that circle. You might want to bring your cursor down to the bottom of this circles node. Now to clean up these glitches, I'm going to use move it you'll see that these clean up a little bit better than the nodeless track. Just pull it out slightly enough to clean up the glitch. I'm not seeing any catenaries here that I want to get rid of. However, with dynamic procedural track, you have the option of using adaptive networks to remove some unwanted catenaries. Just click remove catenary. If you don't see one disappear, unselect the checkbox. You can see that catenary disappeared. This is a four-way train intersection which allows both of these outside connections to get into the rail yard and into the downtown area and allows the rail yard to get to the outside connection on this side and this side. So now I need to connect up my tracks.
Now I need to elevate my passenger line above this train intersection. So thank you for watching The Old Boar Plays City Skylines. Take care now.